we're trying to give small businesses all the benefits that they would have, you know, uh, or all the benefits that a big company with a big finance team and a big budget have, but offer them on a fractional basis to them. So they only really pay for what they need, right? So um, this is like, you know, in sp- instead of hiring, let's say, internal finance people, um and you know getting a getting the same or if not a better result with a at a fraction of the cost and and, an overhead and that i'm speaking from experience as well is a big pain point for entrepreneurs (laughs) and smaller businesses uh what when you get into it at the beginning you don't realize this that it's not just about putting money into your product it's everything else that goes with it as well to manage and run a business and that price wise and time wise and frustration wise can build very, very, very quickly. So I understand yeah. 100% where your business offering is coming from and why it is so advantageous for someone in my position or anyone listening to this who uh, has a startup business, go to the admin website. Uh, there's a e- Exactly. Yeah. 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 Like, like, pe- like, you know, entrepreneurs are typically, you know, fit into a couple of different buckets, right? But, you know, whether they be creative or, or they're very, you know, forward thinking, you know, or, you know, like say, for example, you know, restaurant owners, right? Rest, like a, it's no, someone doesn't create a set of a restaurant because they want to, you know, let's say do a train to be a part-time bookkeeper and learn how accounts work, right? They want to, business owners want to focus on building their business and doing what they do best. But unfortunately, you know, it comes with the territory of running a business and owning a business that you have to do certain things and you have to keep on top of your finances you have to understand your finances, you know, because ultimately it will, uh, you know, whatever the data says should should determine and and, and uh, go into some of the decisions that you make. You also have to comply with the, you know, with the revenue of the company's house uh, or uh, HMRC in the UK. So, um, you know, all these, it, it's, let's say the unglamorous side of, being an entrepreneur and having your own business is doing the things that, that, you know, that, that we just take off, the, off the plate, off your plate. Right. So, um, because like we're fundamentally rethinking how accounting for small business works, 